Hello. Here's a drawing of a moose. I initially tried to do this one with graphite pencils, but it didn't go so well. I didn't really have much patience, so I decided to do it another time. This time uh, I used charcoal pencils, and I find that they are a lot quicker to work with. Obviously, uh, graphite pencils have their advantages as well, but this particular uh, scene and this drawing seemed to work better for me with a charcoal pencil or maybe I just didn't have enough patience to uh, draw all of this for, with graphite. With, a, with charcoal it was relatively quick. Uh, now a few words about the techniques I used uh, in this drawing before I move on to the drawing process. For this uh, soft background I used uh, the leftovers uh, of uh, charcoal, well, which I got from sharpening. So I just dipped my finger uh, into charcoal dust left from sharpening and I spread it around here to create some sort of a background. As for the fur, I used uh, the usual uh, technique of drawing in the direction of the fur and varying the length of the strokes because as you can see uh, here they needed to be a lot shorter and over here uh, on uh, the back of the moose and around the neck uh, the hair is quite a bit longer but in addition to that I also uh, drew with my eraser this is an eraser and a pencil so I did the sim similar thing that I did with a charcoal pencil only this time I did it with my eraser again uh, trying to pull highlights by making short uh, strokes in the direction of the fur and uh, occasionally I also used um, this uh, blending stump because when you pull highlights with an eraser you get a lot of contrast and they can be uh, a lot lighter uh, because they pick up a lot of charcoal so when I needed to make softer highlights I would occasionally use a uh, clean uh, blending stamp and pull highlights with that because when you make strokes with a uh, blending stamp and if it's clean or relatively clean it will actually lift up some of the charcoal and you will get a similar effect as uh, when you're trying to draw with an eraser but softer with, left, uh, with less contrast. So uh, those are just uh, some of the tex techniques I used. Now let's have a look at the video.